I've got my ARP stud grease, I've got my copper spray, and I've got my head gaskets. Let's see what we can get into with Life with Bilsif's YouTube channel. But we're not doing that today. Welcome to Life with Bilsif. Today, we're gonna go for a drive again. I got to take a few drone pictures of a house today. So I'm just gonna take you along with me for the ride. I'm not gonna really do the droning with you guys because it's on somebody's house, right? So you don't wanna see that stuff. That'll just dick you right over. But I'm gonna take you along for the ride because that's the way I do. That's what I roll, eh? I always take you guys with me. I'm trying to adjust my camera as I'm talking to you. I apologize. And holy Christ, where the hell's the traffic come from? Somebody let me out, please. That would be really nice if, you, if you'd let me out. I'd really appreciate that. Why wouldn't you? If somebody doesn't want to let you out, you just make your way out. Screw everybody, just go out. That's the way you drive, Jim. That's the way I drive, Jim. I'll, I'll tell you what I'm doing with the drone. I'm going over to, how you doing, Caleb? How you doing, bud? Place and take some pictures for him. He want some pictures of the house before it's built and after it's friggin' built, so we're gonna get that done right now. It's payday, which makes it nice because it's extra money day, right? And the wife gets paid this week too, for $55. Friggin' right she does. What are you doing? How the hell are you doing? This guy in this car here must be waiting for his kid in the bus or something. That's what I'm thinking. I got my phone, I got my drone, I got my balls, I got my keys, I've got my batteries. We're good to go, I think. It's a beautiful day out. It's 46 degrees out and it's, what, the... 10th of December, which is for you Celsius guys, I don't know, 12 maybe? Let me see if I can figure it out for you. I'll hit that button. What does that do? Nothing. Let's hit it again. What does this do? Nothing. What does this do? Nothing. Nothing. Oh, it shut my radio off. That's what it did. Nothing does nothing here, Jim, except for shut my radio off. How the hell they shut my radio off? Corey, what's really going on? I hit my OnStar OK button and my radio went off. What the hell? Uh-oh, something down here must connect to something up there. We cocked something over, Captain. We gotta have to pull over for a second here and reboot something. Hey Siri, call dad. Let me know in the comments below how many of your phones called your dad. Why wouldn't you? We gotta pull over for a minute. Something's deckered over here. Something's all cocked up. Okay, shut everything off. Hey, I called my dad, it did. Why is this thing flashing? There it goes, it's off. Reset. Okay, let's see if the radio comes back on. There we go. Holy! So whatever I touch there, we won't touch that again. Hey Siri, call mom. Why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't I be doing that to you? Hurt! Hurt. So I haven't had much luck selling the uh, Maverick Mini because everybody wants it for next to nothing because they can buy a new one. 200 bucks less, or 150 bucks less. We'll go ahead and buy a new one. See if I freaking care. Why would I? I just noticed one thing, I'm missing a battery. What the hell happened to that battery, I wonder? Is this charged? Probably not. Oh, it is. Is this charged? Probably not. Oh, it is. Careful. Where the hell did my other battery go? It must be downstairs. I gotta hurry up and get where I'm going here before it's dark out. It gets dark early, it does. It's 3.30 right now, and if I don't hurry up, we're gonna be dicked. South Point Kubota, good place, good people. Freaking right there. And I just flew by a cop doing 100, in the 70. Why wouldn't I? You know, it is what it is. How you doing, bud? The biggest thing when you pass a cop and you know you're speeding, don't hit the brakes. Just keep going because if he looks in his mirror and sees you hit the brakes, he knows you've been speeding. Friggin' tip of the day for dirty old Bill If you see a cop and you know you're speeding, don't hit the brakes, Jim. Cock yourself right over, you would. Why is that a 70 zone back there anyways? Oh, 43 on the other side of the overpass. Hey Siri, what is red? Have a listen to that. She'll teach you a thing or two. So I got thinking last night anyways, I was gonna sell my Maverick Mini, I'll be honest with you, to get the Maverick Mini 2. But I thought to myself, why even bother? Why not just buy another Maverick Air 2 without the Flymore patch, because I already got batteries, and that would be a backup drone. Leave it in the box, don't fly it, it's brand new. If this anything happens to this old girl, they just bring that one out. So that's what I think I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna skip the whole Maverick Mini thing altogether because in all honesty, they're not as good because they don't have collision avoidance or nothing. They just, you crash them into whatever you want to crash them into. It's just they're nice because you don't need a license for them. So everybody in their Tom, Dick, and brother will be out with Maverick Minis flying everywhere. 
because they don't need a license, so they don't think they have to follow the rules. I follow the rules most of the time. The only time I don't follow the rules is I'm trying to get the shot for you guys. Sometimes I'll go a little bit out of my limits. Everybody does that. It's part of life, it is. You gotta go out of your limits to get the shot sometimes. What do you think of that? My glasses are cocked. I cannot clean these things. They are so scratched. They're just absolutely dicked. Don't buy prescription glasses from Walmart, just saying. They cock you right over. They just, you might as well just bend over and get a rod stuck up your ass. So that's about as good as they are. Oh, there's some firewood in there. A little firewood action. The sky looks awesome today. I'm gonna try to use that to my advantage for a couple pictures. Oh, decent. Figure Oh, the boys are over here working again. Oh, they never stop, Captain. <laughs> Don't you worry about me, bud. Just keep building the fucking house. I gotta put this thing on to charge my phone because my phone is deader than dicks. So I gotta remember how to do this. The home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. Okay. Phone charging on. There we go. Oh! Take a few pictures for Caleb. That'd be a new way of checking it on you, eh? Landing. See you later, boys. We're not travel. See you later. There we go, Captain. Pictures all pictured up. Frame it right there. Private property. No trespassing. No play your game. Well, there you go. I took you for a quick rip to show you what I was doing today. Just an update from the dirty old Belsif, because that's what I do. I keep you guys informed and up to date on my daily activities as much as I freaking can. Do you believe me? Probably not. Don't forget to subscribe and like it. Hit the notification bell bar button if you like this kind of stuff. Leave me a comment down below and let me know if you like these driving around videos with Dirty Old Bills. This is the way I really actually started my channel is driving around talking to you guys. So I guess it's not always all about doing something because sometimes driving around is a great way of doing something with you guys. Makes sense, probably not. Oh, dick, what happened to that tree? It's all cocked over. Oh, boy, careful. But it's off a few minutes early today, about uh, an hour, about an hour. I had to drop a vehicle off that I picked up this morning, so I want to do a fly over this guy's property sometime with you guys, but I gotta get a hold of him and see if it's okay, because it's pretty cool in there. It's all like in a gully. We're in a gully right now, we are. We're gonna come back out of it right now. But I like to fly around there where the cows are out, maybe, and go over and do a little boo and this and that and the other thing. I gotta power wash the old truck tomorrow too. Remind me of that. We got chicken tonight. We're gonna do some chicken. Chicken, potatoes, and some veggies for dinner tonight. Wifey Poo said. That's gonna be friggin' decent. I'm looking forward to that. We'll have an LS video this weekend. Let me comment down below if you wanna see that. That's what we'll do this weekend. We're gonna put the heads back on, get them torqued down, roll her around, put the oil pan back on, and then we can button up that. You can set her off to the side and put the transmission. I was gonna borrow Brian's engine stand, but I figured I'll just get the engine put back together, move it, and then I'll put the transmission on the stand and we'll start cleaning it up, because it's a mess. We're gonna have to wire wheel that whole transmission to clean her up, clean up the brackets, paint them, put the shift kit in, I got a transco kit for it, so we'll slap that in. Then I gotta wait for the stall converter to show up. Oh, brother. The money, boys. I'm just gonna slide home here, get everything packed up, go downstairs, do some looking at what I got. Hopefully slap you up a video or two, or maybe one, or maybe half of one, or maybe not even one. It depends how this turns out, because I'm gonna just cock the whole thing over and I'll probably look at it and say, what's really going on? And I'm kinda tired, so I just kinda feel like going to sleep, to be honest with you. But we'll see. I'm glad you're here. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for my long-term subscribers. I appreciate you're here. Thanks for all the new subscribers. I'm glad you're here. I wouldn't be doing this without you. Friggin' right I wouldn't. Love y'all. Stay safe. You know what to do for now.